Hi, my name is Jason. Hi, my name is Kelly Ewing. And I'm one part. And I'm the other part of Equilibrium. In Gallery One. I spent um, a lot of time at the Cypress College of Art back in uh, back in the 90s, and I was kind of influenced by sort of post-impressionism, I guess, um, and expressionism. Um, and I went on to travel sort of in the Middle East for about two years. So my work was quite heavily influenced by, you know, crossing borders and you know border spaces. Um, and I've kind of and that's kind of stayed with, with my work, you know, ever since. I find myself sort of situated in a weird place between painting and sculpture and installation, which during my undergraduate was, it wasn't really represented. So I find myself like I'm like a little explorer. I like to find a new way through things, like a new solution for a painting, installation and sculpture, sort of like, little triad where they join in the middle. So I think of myself kind of as an explorer and just sort of like discovering new things and powering through and a lot of my work is made from really cheap materials. I'm not precious, the work is moved around, it's ripped off the stretcher, threw back on, air beds are just cut up if they don't work, like I can be quite dramatic. Um, well, I entered quite last minute into the, into the show. Um, and I remember, you know, going along to the show and just looking around at all the artwork, all the one, you know, and it was just quite thinking, this is brilliant, you know, I'll walk around and I'll just go home, you know. And then it was announced at the end that, you know, I'd won the prize jointly with, with Kelly. And, um, and I, I was just very stunned and shocked and uh, someone had to say my speech for me because I was unable to do it myself. The work works together good now because it's all hung and we can see how it looks, but I think it provides a nice balance. Just with crazy air beds, which is just not traditional painting with more traditional aspects, it's just a nice juxtaposition. Main thing is I hope people can sort of look at non-traditional art objects as art. It doesn't always have to be something that is told to you that is stereotypical art. Like it, it doesn't have to be a sculpture. It doesn't have to be a painting on canvas. It can be something else. It can be something ridiculous. It can be something off the bat. It can be something low culture that you've brought up. I hope that they can see a kind of link to the romanticism that you know I find in travel or in experiencing different places. Um, but also, you know, the sort of formal aspects of the work um, uh, where the experience of the, of the object or the painting is, you know, experienced through the materiality of, of the paint. And I want people to just sort of have a new appreciation for things that aren't always appreciated, really. 